Hi, this is Ellen at Crazy For You, and I want to show you a bind off method that is going to keep your bind off from getting too tight. We're using it on our first Friday project, the 1 and 8 cowl. It's called the suspended bind off. And you're going to start as you would a normal bind off with your two stitches on your right hand needle and lift that first stitch up and over and off. But rather than dropping that stitch that you've just lifted over, keep it on your left needle and go in and make your second stitch. So then take both of those stitches off at the same time. And what that does is it holds the stitch that normally collapses as you make your bind off. It holds it open so that it's a little more stretchy. I'll show you that again. Up and over, make your next stitch and take them both off at the same time. Up and over, make your next stitch, take it off at the same time. So if you're going back and forth from knit and purl, you're going to want to drop that stitch off so that you can bring your yarn forward. And I'll show you what this looks like purl-wise. Two stitches, up and over, and you're going to come forward and make your purl-wise bind off. You're getting closer to me. Sorry. <laughs> I have my camera person, Ginny, here. So let's, let's look at purlwise once more. We're working in the front, purlwise, both stitches off. And there you have it. Thanks so much for watching.